Hi! Something else you've all been getting very good at is the shape game. Do you remember your straight shape? And your tuck shape? And your straddle? And your star? And your L? And your pike, motorbike, and front support, back support, and your dish. Oh, sofa's in the way. And arch. Hope you can see that down there. If not, I hope you remember what your arch was from when you were at gymnastics. All right, let's see if we can move through them a bit quicker. Show me your motorbike shape. Straddle. Star, motorbike, back support, straight, arch, dish, tuck, star, support, straddle, back support, Whew. I hope some people were faster than me, let's do something to keep us all strong in each of those shapes, so let's start off with straight shape, and I'm going to see who can go up on their toes and back down again. Make sure you're squeezing your tummy in. Squeeze all your legs tight. Arms up at your ears. Toes. And down again. Let's do that five times. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Up. Down. Very good. And let's do what we plan out a tuck shape. Ah, this is a good one. I think some people are going to be good at this. Make sure you've got room behind you. Going to see my nice tuck shape. Go to rock back and try and stand up. Oh, so you need to lean forward the way you do after a forward roll. See if you can stand up again. And give it a go. Have a few tries of that. You can pause the video if you want to keep going a wee bit longer. I'm worried my video will keep cutting off, so I'm going to go on to the next one. Ooh, it's star shape. And we don't usually do this one, so it's opposite hands to opposite foot. Touch, and this hand up here, nice and straight. Other side. Other side, other side, and then I'm going to do that fast five times, not too fast. One, two, three, four, five, six. Was that five times? No. I thought I'd better make it an even number so we could do the same on both sides. Now in a straddle. Can you put two hands either side of one leg? See if you can lift the leg up. Here we go up. Make sure your hands are in front of you. Don't be cheating back here. So let's see if you can lift one leg up five times. One, two, three, four, five. And the other leg, hand either side in front of you. 
Does it work? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five. Now it is really hard. If you feel your legs not moving, but you're able to give it a try, you're working all the right muscles. So as long as it's not too sore, don't worry about it. All right, in our pike shape. I'm going to point your toes all the way down and toes all the way up. Point your toes down and see if my toes are on camera or not. Oh, I hope they are. Hmm. Down and up. Can you point them down and we're going to count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and then you're going to push them up as far as you can. Push them really tight, make sure your knees stay down. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Well done. You want an L. Oh, here's a, a challenge in my nice L shape. Can you wiggle forwards? Don't let your arms fall down. Don't let your back all crush. Keep your L and backwards. So that's a bit of a funny one. But I tell you what, I can feel my tummy muscles and my leg muscles working so that I can move forwards and backwards in my L. Motorbike, check your motorbike works. If your motorbike works, then you're going to stay there for, you ready? A nice low motorbike. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whoa! Definitely getting stronger. Front support, I think we all know what we're going to do in front support. Let's do five press ups. One, unless you're tightest, then you can do 10. Three, four, five, Ooh, can we try that? from our back support going backwards. So I'm trying to bend my elbows, but not let my bottom fall all the way down. One, two, so I keep sucking my tummy up. Three, four, five. That's quite tricky, so you maybe can do it at the side of a sofa as well. Four, five, and for this dish, I'm going to keep my arms forward. You can have them backwards. Uh, your ears, if you have enough room, if your tummy's strong enough. In my dish, I'm going to look to rock if I can. Back and forward. Let's go. One and two and. Three and four and five and then hold one, two, three, four, five. Last one, arch. Here's my arch. So if you're ready, I'm going to do the same rocks and then a hold. If you can. Now I know there's a few people with stiff shoulders that makes it hard. So you can, let's have our arms at our ears. If you can, you can have them at your ears. But if we're all squashed in the house anyway, at your ears is fine. And that's a bit easier on your shoulders. Although it is hard, so don't worry if it's tricky. Arch, I'm going to try and go forwards and backwards. One, two, three, four, five. 
move and then I'm going to hold. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And that was a lot of good work with your shapes. So if you gave all of them a try, well done. And I can't wait to see you again soon.